When did you leave your house? We did everything right. You know, we left on Sunday morning. We took the dog, the cats, the kids. You know, we did everything right. We left, and then we came home, and it was gone. And, and for you, what's, what's the next step? I mean, where are you staying? <sighs> We're staying at a sister's house in, in South Plainfield, and um, just trying to build on, but it's been like every day just emotionally draining because I'm trying to keep it strong for the girls, but you know, it's hard. How, how are they doing? I mean, how are your kids? I mean, they're they... <laughs> tired. <laughs> they're tired. Yeah. But, you guys you know. doing all right? No? You're doing good? <laughs> you know. Were you, ab were you able to salvage? <sighs> we, we, we tried to get some of like our books, but you know, they were all born in October and all their birthdays. We just had a party last Saturday at my house and it was wonderful. Now everything is, all their stuff is gone. So, you know, just trying to get some of the memories that we have, you know, it's, it's hard. I think, you know, losing like baby clothes and, you know, hair and all, you know, things that from them that we have from growing up is gone, you know, it's the hardest part. And for you, what's it been like? I just think that, you know, when, when you pull up to a home that you've built from ground up and uh, you have so many memories with your family and, and us being sisters and, and being as close as we are and to pull up to see both of our homes demolished was um, something you can't even describe. Um, pictures don't give it enough justice. And uh, as, as a family, you just need to come together. Um, and very similar to the gentleman's story before us, uh, our community is phenomenal. As soon as we pulled up to the house, everybody came running out and hugging us and the police and uh, the mayor and, and, and our councilwoman. They have just been unbelievable and supportive. And it's, you know, these times like this, your family is the most important thing and, and your friends. And we're very lucky. Um, we have three beautiful young ladies that, that need a family to help them right now get through this tough time. Yeah. Um, oh, I know, I mean, just their immediate needs that you guys have. Uh, we, we wanted to just get, get you some cash, first of all. So each, each of you, we're going to be getting you $2,500 worth. Thank you. Just Thank to, you. you know, help Thank out with immediate much. needs. Thank you. I appreciate uh, it. Also, uh, the Burlington Coat Factory giving gift cards for, for coats and clothing, bedding, kitchen supplies, things like that. Thank you. So I hope that's just Thank a, a start, a little, little bit of help. Um, and, and for Mike, for, for your community, um, we've uh, partnered with Kellogg Company. They've donated two semi trucks worth about $100,000 worth of food uh, is going to be delivered uh, by Feeding, uh, Feeding America so, uh, to the folks in, in your community thank and around. You. Uh, so we hope that's at least a starting. Yeah, I wish you the sure. best. Thank you very much. You stay, uh, stay strong. Help.